I look like a mess. I feel like a mess. I sound like a mess. But we're gonna vlog today. Why is my hair? Like, it looks so ugly. We're gonna vlog today. Um, we have a couple things to do. And then tonight we are going to Kentucky to stay in like a cute little Airbnb. So I just thought it would be fun to bring you guys with. It's nine o'clock. I just laid Lucy. No, it's like 9.30 actually. I just laid Lucy down to nap. She is taking naps in her crib now, which is like godsend. So I'm gonna clean up in here and in the bathroom and get ready for the day, hopefully before she wakes up. So, um, I was able to get dressed at least before she woke up. <sighs> She's still awake, She's just laying in her crib. And every time she starts crying, I just go and put her phone back in her mouth, but I try not to get frustrated and I really like I don't get frustrated that often but we were doing so good she was going like two hour stretches in her crib and then the past like two or three days it's been like as soon as I lay her down she wakes up and I know that she's tired and like if I just let her cry like she would fall asleep but like I just cannot I can't do it and I'm frustrated Be a bond. Your hair looks a mess. She's asleep. <laughs> um, she has been out for, I don't know, like 10 minutes now, maybe. I have not gone to, let me set you up here. I have not gone to the metaphysical store yet because I just wanted to let her have her normal. So I'm gonna wait for her to wake up. It's currently 1.30. She's probably gonna wake up somewhere around three o'clock if it's a good nap, 3.30 maybe. So when she wakes up, we'll go. And then I think we're going to go to my grandma's house and visit for a little bit. And then, I don't know, there's this pumpkin carving thing in downtown that my mom wants to go to. So we might go do that today. I'm kind of just trying to fill up the rest of the day until Miguel gets off work and we go to Kentucky. So I'm also like <laughs> really nervous that she's going to wake up. So I'm going to show you guys. This is what my room looks like right now. It's honestly not awful. Like, not too bad. The bathroom is, again, not awful. But, like, definitely needs to be cleaned. So, that's what we're gonna do. I'm gonna turn on a podcast and just clean my little heart out. Do you know what I mean? Oh my god, you guys. You will never guess who is awake. So, it's 2.15. She's probably been up for like 15 minutes now or something. So barely an hour. Barely an hour, huh? <laughs> barely an hour. Mom almost got the bathroom clean. She was so close, so close. <laughs> so I just fed her. I think we're gonna run in a bath, get our errands done, go see grandma. Do you wanna go see grandma? Do you wanna go see great grandma? <laughs> What are you doing? Are you playing? Are you playing? Yeah. Are you playing? One, two, three. <laughs> oh my gosh. That was a little bit difficult, huh? Let's bounce out, girly. It's just like a stone for love and prosperity and like wellness. It's just really, really beautiful. Anyways, we just got home. So I'm going to go pack up all of our stuff really quick and then we're gonna jump back in the car. Alrighty, we got our bag. We got a bottle, we've got mommy's drink. I definitely walked through a freaking spider web. 
and I feel it all over me, which is like giving me a lot of anxieties. But there's a spider on me somewhere. Anyways, okay, we've got like a 30 minute drive to Miguel and then like an hour and a half drive past Miguel. So I brought a bottle so that it would be a little bit easier to feed her when she gets hungry, but she's eaten, she's changed. Um, honestly, she should be ready for a nap. So we're probably gonna have like a good little fussy period on the way to Miguel and then hopefully she'll sleep on the rest of the way there, but we'll see how it freaking goes. Hi, you guys. It is much, much later, 9.30 to be exact. It took us a lot to get here. Lou is right here. Say hi. I'll give you guys a little tour in just a second. I'm kind of just like getting her jammies on and getting her situated because she's very tired and it was a very long drive to get here, so. Miguel's outside taking a shower because there's only an outside shower. I'm about to throw some pizza rolls in the oven because that's what we picked up from Walmart to eat. And I have concluded that I watched too many murder documentaries because the entire time that we were trying to get in the place, there was no lights on. So we were in the dark and I was convinced that somebody was going to come and murder us so that's great it did not happen but i really genuinely thought it was going to what <laughs> miguel is on top of the car there's like a way to get up to the roof or whatever so he's up there bless you baby let me put this over here with the wipes So this is the outside shower. Miguel said it was actually really fun and like kind of cool. Where's that door? I'll show you guys more of the outside later, but it's really pretty. Can you go in here? The fridge, so this is the bathroom. Hey. And then they have this cool little thing. Miguel went up there on the roof last night. And then in here. What does little snuggle snuggle? Yeah, it's super cute. Bye-bye. 
the car. We just left. Lulu is already not having it. Hi, you're demanding because I'm talking on the camera. She's already cried and napped and cried some more. And we're stopped at a gas station. So Miguel couldn't get some gas and stuff. We went on the road for like 30 minutes, I think. And then we're about to drop Miguel off at work. And then we're going to drive two hours home so i'm very not excited all right guys as you can see we are home we've been home for a couple hours now it's like four o'clock i think we got home at noon but i will say that the drive home was like better than i could have asked for she cried it was about an hour and 45 minute drive home she cried for the first 25 minutes probably and then the rest of the drive she was passed out dead asleep it was so nice i just like listened to a podcast and drove home in silence it was so nice definitely a way better drive home than drive there which was really nice and i was by myself so like i was very happy but anyways that concludes this week's vlog i hope you guys enjoyed i I had so much fun staying in that train car i will leave the link to the airbnb down below if i can do that i think probably because it was like really awesome it was in kentucky we loved it it was great so tell us where we should go next where we should stay anyways i love you guys so much i hope you come back next week next week will be a breastfeeding q a i got a ton of requests to do that so you guys asked me some good questions on instagram so that will go up next week but yeah i love you so much follow all my social media down below I will see you next week.